simple challenge we like to do. It's pretty self-explanatory. We are first gonna try and make the smallest cookie we possibly can, then the mediumest, whatever that is. I think that's just normal. That doesn't really matter. The middle doesn't really matter. What matters is the large part. Then we're gonna see who can make the largest cake, and whoever wins the rounds wins the game. That's it, it's pretty simple. Let's go. This time it's gonna make cake. Not your butt, but the one that you bake. For my mini cake, I want to use these already mini cake and I want to make it even more minis. And I want to make this a triple stack layer. So what we're gonna do, first we're gonna try it. Uh, I'm using a cap to make a perfect little, oh man, perfect little cake. Look at that, it's a cake! All right, sorry about that. <laughs> Got excited there. Now, we're gonna put some frosting on top of it, and then we're gonna make another cake. And that's a double layer cake. Let's do a triple layer. All right, triple layer is good enough because this is supposed to be mini. And I just realized putting a triple layer is not so mini. Technically, a cupcake is a cake. So I'm gonna make mini cupcakes and then make my mini cake with this that I've never tried, but it is gluten free and keto. So let's try it. I'm having the hardest time with this frosting. I don't know what kind of frosting this is, but this is not an appetizing cake. It needs to be appetizing. All right, so I'm just gonna start by mixing all my ingredients which is this, three eggs, one third of cup of oil, and a half a cup of water, and now I just mix it all. I've never tried this one, so I hope it tastes good, because if it does, I'm gonna continue to buy it. By the way, I'm not sure if I already said it, but this is keto and gluten-free, so I'm excited to try it, and I wonder how many mini cupcakes it can make. So for the small cake, I decided I'm not gonna bake anything because I feel like that's a bit too much work for a tiny little cake. I decided to get this pre-made pound cake, lemon pound cake, it's perfect. And I got my tiny little utensils here. So we're gonna grab a pound cake. And I found this, this glass, it's literally perfect. We're gonna make this a two layer cake. That's exactly what happened to mine, Amira. Oh my God, what happened to yours? What's gonna happen to you, Amira? So don't make fun of it. This is as best as I can get it. Okay, so I am going to cut this cake in half because then it's gonna be too tall and it's just gonna lose its structure. Right, so I'm gonna put some pan so it doesn't get all like stuck in there and we'll see how many will fit. Okay, I think that's good enough. Now let's just pour it in there. Very slowly so I don't make a mess. Ah. All right, so it filled up the whole tray and I still have some batter left. So I think it's, it's a lot. So I'm just gonna put it in here now and leave it in here for 20 minutes and I'll be back. Yay, time to frost. I'm gonna, I got this frosting bag, it's giant. However, I'm gonna cut. That's a tiny piece. That way, hopefully, I can frost it better. I'm gonna use this tiny knife to frost it too. First, I've got three different pieces. I was just gonna do two. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with two. First, we're gonna frost this part. I think I might need to make the frosting hole a little bit bigger. This looks like a pimple. Okay, we got a turntable here now. We're professionals. Yeah, it's not working. Come on, the cake is tiny. Hey, uh, Amira, your cake is gonna turn out like mine. Which, it's fine, it looks great. I think I should- If my cake turns out like yours, you can take the win. And they are done. They seem a little weird, but- That looks like you went outside and grabbed dirt and put it right? in Right? That's what I thought, they look kind of weird. Done frosting it, now I'm gonna put some sprinkles over it. I'm done. So I'm gonna cut the top off and I'm going to put it like that and I think I'm just gonna leave it like that and I'm gonna put this keto frosting that I also found that is really good. I tried it and it's really, really good. So I'm just gonna put it on it. This is, this is really good. Here are our cakes. It's time to judge them. Ready? Ready, What's I'm ready. Me. Paul, he is brave today. I have the biggest, baddest cake out there. Try it. It is going to be the best tasting one. I'm gonna win for it. Did you wash that? Alright, anybody wants a piece? Oh, look at that. That's a beautiful piece, isn't it? It cuts real nice. That's a that piece for nice. you, and that's a piece for you, Amira. And I don't really want to eat it, so. Uh, Why don't you? Uh, I think, I, I don't know about you, but I feel like we can agree that we could just take this one out of the voting process because these two look better. Yeah, I think so. I agree. Okay, great. I agree. It's just down to Jetta and me now. Let's go. I'll go next. I want to try it. That looks good. Go. Pretty good. I like it. All right? Mm-hmm. My turn. I don't like lemon. Yeah, you do. You love sour things. No, not in cake. All right, my turn, and I'm totally gonna win. Right? Who wants to go first? Me, 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 me. All right. Look at it. Look at it. Wait, 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 wait. Let's admire it. I like chocolate cake. 
So how is it? Um, I'd say it looks better than Paul's. Paul's turn. Yeah. Are you trying to tell me you didn't like it? I have my vote. I, I want to try it. It's time for voting. Who do you vote for? Myself. Okay, well, obviously she votes for me. I vote for her. Paul, I guess it's just down to you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I'm gonna vote for Mira's. Yes! No! What? Yes. Yes! Can I remind you, Amira took you out of the competition. I know. But I deserve it. It is now time for the second round. Now, this round is literally just a regular cake. So basically, just try and make the best cake you can. Let's go. I don't know what you guys are talking about, but my cake is the best. Like I said, this is the next round. It's just a normal round. So I'm just gonna make this cake very quickly. Nothing needs to be special. Three eggs, some oil, water, and we mix. Okay, so I decided to go with strawberry cake because I love strawberries. And like Amira said, this one is just a normal cake. So I'm just gonna grab everything and mix it. You know what? Every day I feel like I'm a better baker. I feel like so natural doing this. I'm going with super moist French vanilla. Mmm, I love vanilla cake. Let's go. Anything vanilla is delicious. All right, let's see what we got here. One cup water, half a cup vegetable oil, and three eggs. Oh, look at that. It's already here. I call this Flappy Joe. Or is it called Cakey Joe? I don't know. How about you guys comment down below what you guys think this cake is called? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. And in the oven it goes. That is not French vanilla. It doesn't smell like French vanilla. All right, so I'll put my spray in there and I'm just gonna put my cake batter all in here for my normal strawberry delicious cake. So my batter, very easy peasy. Now I'm going to put it into the pan. I did not oil that. So we're gonna leave that and hopefully it doesn't come out too bad. If it does, I'm gonna be stuck with only one cake. But we gotta oil it first, guys. And I'm not done. Hopefully this one comes out a little bit. I don't know, but we'll see. All right, my cakes are done now and we're gonna put them right here. Let's go. That, no! What? We're gonna save this. It's all right, guys. Um, I'm realizing something, though. I don't think I am the best baker. This is not the best cake I've ever made. And technically, it might be, actually. It's not about the looks. It's about what's inside, which means as long as it tastes good, I could win. All right, let's go with vanilla frosting. We're gonna keep it all fresh and vanilla. Oh, man. I need help! <laughs> What am I doing wrong? It came out perfect. Now we put it on. <gasps> manifested. Manifested. It it did, it kind of did. It almost did. You know, I just mm, it smells good. It smells like strawberries. It's good. I think I did great. I need a pat on the back. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this baking videos are really helping me become a really good baker. Now I'm just gonna set it here and put my frosting on it and then I'll decorate it and I'll win this round. And now I put it the, ooh. I don't know what's going on, but I'm becoming really good at this. Look at that. I'm almost a professional. Nice. Now I gotta be careful in this part because it was a little broken, remember? Okay, my cakes are done, and I think this one is the one that the, uh, it doesn't have any oil. So we're gonna put that out first. I'm gonna put it out of its misery first. I'm gonna try and cut it out. I think these are actually non-stick pans, so hopefully they're not lying. <laughs> Ta-da! All right, so we're gonna scratch this cake because I can't do anything with it. I'm not gonna do a paw where, you know, I try and panic and I put a bunch of freaking frosting. And maybe I can do something with it after. Maybe I can make it a two-tier cake and like the top part can be like smaller. But we're just gonna work with this cake. If you don't come out right, I'm gonna get angry. Ah, <laughs> oh, thank goodness. So first things first, I gotta level this cake because it has that top part. So I just overheard Amira that she cuts like the top part off and she scraps cakes that are broken. Come on, why would you do that? Ooh, look at my second cake, it looks amazing. Now, I'm gonna just hide the whole broken mess underneath because that's what that's what's underneath is for, is just to hide the broken mess. Just frost the top. Oh yeah, it's looking beautiful this time. Oh yeah, no yeah, I'm gonna have the tallest nice cake here. All right, I got this little piece from my broken cake. Um, it's not gonna look the greatest, but it's there and it's the best I can do. So we're gonna put this inside. So now we're just gonna frost it. My cake melted the frosting. I think I should have waited till it was cold. So I'm going to try it again. I was doing so good and now I'm a little scared. All right, let, let me try it again. Hopefully I'll be as, it's working. I really think I'm getting the hang of this. I think my cake's still hot though. Okay, now it's time to decorate. Do this right. Paul! 
This is exactly what I needed. Oh my gosh, I've been looking for red frosting everywhere. Thank you, Jay. Oh yeah, how does that look? What does that remind you of, huh? Isn't it perfect? Excuse you. Back to my cake. I'm going to make a little continue and forget about Paul's rudeness. Hopefully I have enough left because Paul took it from me. Look at my cake. Looks like a Minecraft cake, right? Guys, don't forget to subscribe. I am attempting right here, guys, to be a real baker. I'm done with this and I tried to make the top look as best as I could. I'm gonna try a new decorating tactic. And I'm gonna top it off with sprinkles. I'm finished. Here are the cakes, and it it's now time to judge them. Paul, you will go first. We have this uh, Minecraft cake, I heard you say. Minecraft and cake. Personally, it looks pretty good, but it kind of also looks like a red bird came and pooped on it several times. Let's try. Looks like good cake. Why is it a little, like, looks like it's a little messed up from, like, the bottom? No, no. No, no. We're good. And now yours. That's mine. It's gonna be the best one. They're just strawberry. Subscribe, guys. Subscribe. It says subscribe on there, so make sure you subscribe. This looks weird. It's like what do you mean it looks massive weird? Chunk of cake. Has anybody ever seen that? Like a giant, thick, massive chunk yeah. of cake. Yeah. Yeah. Without frosting. Me? I haven't seen that. How does it taste? <laughs> Excuse you. <laughs> Tastes like strawberries. Do you like it? Um, strawberries are healthy. See, here's the problem. I think we should move on to yours. Yeah. And mine. I don't even know how to cut mine. Like, do I, I got it? Do I just do it in the middle? I got middle, it. Or? You go like this. <gasps> well, I was gonna say yours looks really nice, Amira, but I cut it pretty nice. Let's try my cake. It's not good. Okay, we tried our cakes. We have for after thinking and thinking and thinking. No, I didn't think much. I like Paul's. Okay, uh, I'm gonna have to go with Paul's. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I thought I was gonna lose. I, I'm losing it right now. What? You guys didn't even know this, but you know, it's all crumbly on the bottom. <laughs> I win. Why would you tell us? Yeah, well, it doesn't matter. You guys already <laughs> voted. Ha! <laughs> In your faces. I don't think it matters if it's crumbly on the bottom. It's, you it, made it look it, nice and it was okay. Yeah, it tastes good, it's moist, and it looks nice. The problem with your cake is it was too sweet. So I didn't really like it. It still look nice. And it's that subscribe. Guys, subscribe. You though. Because me next time I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win the next round. And it is now time for the last and final round for the largest cake. It's kinda late, so I think we should do this tomorrow. In day two now, and we are ready to make that cake. Are you ready? I am so ready, but I I am so tired. So I'm been drinking coffee and that's gonna help me because it's gonna be a lot of work. Mm. Hey, Paul, you ready? Oh, I'm ready for this. I went to the store and I got more supplies. I got cake boxes, giant pans, so I'm gonna make a ginormous cake, double size, this tall. It's gonna be amazing. So yesterday when I was making my cake, I got exhausted. Baking, let me tell you, it's tiring. So when I went to Walmart, I found all this cakes. Amira said that she just wanted it, the, you know, the biggest one and the bestest cake. So I'm just gonna decorate it. This is cake, right? She said cake. And I am going to win this round and relax. So for my giant cake, guys, I'm gonna be making it from scratch because I don't like those cake boxes. I don't like the way that they taste and I don't, they, they, they crumble up. So I'm gonna be making a sponge cake because sponge cakes are fluffy and you have to fluff everything up. So I'm thinking that it'll be easier to make more bigger cakes, you know what I'm saying? So now I just gotta sit and watch this video. All right, I got all my ingredients here. This is three sets of cake. Holy moly, that's a lot of cake. Wow. I wonder if three sets is gonna cover just one pan or at least two pans. I'm hoping two pans, because that's a lot of cake. You know what? I think I'm just gonna sit and play the slimatory game while Paul and Amira bake their cakes, because they're gonna take forever. I'm, I'm really smart. I think it's gonna be one pan. Are you kidding me? Three batters for one pan? That's insane. And after like two hours, I'm finally done with my first batch. It is five batches. However, it took way too long. I gotta hurry, because Paul literally, I think, he, we already put his massive tray in the oven, and he's starting on his second one, so I gotta, I gotta hurry. Just like Amira said, my cakes just got done. Would you look at this? Would you look at that? I'm looking oh, at it. It's not even sticky, look. I don't even know where to put this, but it's not even sticky to the tray. I'm so excited. All right, let's take, let's see how this cake turns. Perfect. It's literally, literally perfect. I don't think I've made a cake that was better than this one. <laughs> I'm surprised. Wow. I guess I gotta go big or go home, huh? Now we pour all of this in, and this will be our third layer. 
and I'm gonna work on the fourth layer. We haven't stopped. It's getting nighttime again, and I haven't seen Jay anywhere. I think she's just yeah, been playing all day. Been? I'm on my fourth cake, my fourth and final cake, by the way. While well, you've made like seven massive cakes. Eight massive cakes, and I'm not done because I am winning this. I already got one win. That means I just need this one more win to win the entire challenge. I'm ready. Let's go. I'm not losing energy. Look at this. Look at this cake. This one's the next one. Going in. Oh, I forgot about the challenge. You guys are still working. It's morning. I've been working through the night and I'm done. I mean, I gotta, I gotta kick my things up. Did I sleep through the night? Okay, so I guess it's time for me to start, I mean, continue with my cakes. So I'm going to start by putting, I mean, continue, by putting my frosting on my cake in here, on top of each of the layers so they stick. I'm all done with my cakes, they're all cooled off now, and honestly, guys, don't know what went wrong, but they're really hard. But maybe they'll be better for frosting and sturdy-wise. So, we're gonna ignore that. I'm gonna cut the tops off, and while I do that, I'm gonna make my frosting. I'm gonna use heavy whipping cream and powder sugar. Let's go. It's frosting time. Let's do it. So, I'm not good at frosting things. I need help! <laughs> am I doing wrong? Oh, but this cake is so good, it doesn't even matter. Check this out. I know buttercream goes in the middle, but ain't nobody got time for that. I've been working all night and I'm tired and I wanna go to sleep, so. Next layer, let's go chocolate. Woo! <laughs> Look at that. Layer number three. Oh, I took some of my cake? What? All right, that's fine. Fourth layer. Fifth layer. This is getting tall. Paul is on his fifth layer, and this is all I have. Four layers. And I only leveled out one. I'm just gonna finish this challenge just to finish this challenge at this point, but guys, I am not winning. Next layer. I lost count, to be honest. And the only thing that has gone right in this entire challenge for me is my frosting. This tastes so freaking good. All right, we're gonna put that there. And this is looking really good, and I'm on to my last layer. I think this is coming out perfect. All right, time to make it pretty. Last layer. Whoa! I might cut this in half and just make it literally this tall. I want to do that so bad, but it's already wiggly. I don't know if I should. So I think this is looking good, but I feel like it's going to fall, so I had a great idea. I'm just going to stick this in here, and it should hold it. And nobody will ever notice. And we're frosting this one. This is probably my last layer. Not probably, definitely my last layer, because I don't have any more cake. So I have two options here. I'm going to cut the sides, make straight lines so the cake looks really beautiful, or keep it like this and just cover up in whipped cream or some other stuff so it's bigger i want to cut it i want to cut it i want to just do it oh man i hate cutting this beautiful cake oh it cuts so nice though okay so it seems like this is not working really good so i'm gonna try this this is better it's a little high that's okay i can fix it all right and now the final touch so i bought this little zebra cake and I'm gonna just put them around it, one on the top, and then I'm gonna put some more around it. Everything is cut, time to frost. Oh yes. So I think this is working out really good. My cake is getting higher and higher. And all I have to do is put these little cakes around it with frosting. And I'm done with frosting, now I'm gonna add my finishing touch. Sprinkle. <laughs> oh my we, God. Got, we got one elimination. You're eliminated! Woo! No, I'm not! Scared. I can see this! How did it <laughs> dive over here? How? I can pick up my cake. I got it! I got it! I saved it! It's, this is it's, fortified, Jay. It's no, it's not. I can fix this. Look, I got it. It's all in one piece. Okay, so I have an idea. I don't think this worked. So I'm just gonna swish all the little zebra cakes in there. And I think that should help. I mean, it might not look nice, but it's still gonna be tall, right? I still have a chance. Well, while Paul's finishing up his cake, we have finished our cake. And I think we should get extra points for that. Hey, That's hold on. Because he's not hold done. On. Yeah, no, I agree. Well, I think yours is pretty much the win. He's turning into a Minecraft cake on top of it now, so it's looking really cool. He's actually taking his time on this. And yeah. I'm, you know, I, winning that second round, I, I got surprised and I was like, I gotta win the third round. Done!